Kurapika is currently drowning. It's a meme. It's from Hunter x Hunter. And there's like, do you know these like previews for the next episode? Pretty long. We're wrong. Do you know? No, I know. I know. I just don't know what it's like. Hunter, yeah, but that's what I wanted to explain. So in Hunter x Hunter, in one episode, there was a preview, and it basically just said, Kurapika is currently drowning. See, look, I am still in here. Yeah. I mean, it's probably better that you're, 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 you're a human head with just a pumpkin. Instead of just, you know, the head being the pumpkin, because that's what I thought. I mean, it's like I was, like, eating a person. I was so happy with my eyes. Oh, I'm glad I was mm. not eating. Pumpkin. 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 They're fighting again. Are they gonna circle each other? It doesn't really look like fighting, it's more like a crawl. Should we stop this? Because if they keep fighting, we might have an entire rat and um, penguin war. Oh no. I don't know. Last thing we need to be fighting, we might have a consumer's body as no, the other one is also Legion, but it has, because they, uh, they want to use it for a oh, uh, there's a few things they've changed, for example, there's this, uh, giant ugly video player in one of the key areas, and we don't want that, and we can't contact the world creator to do anything about it, so I'm happy, I'm happy to use it. Oh, and, uh, yeah. not having that video play in that key spot. Oh, and I'm also adding teleporters around to not only ease movement, but also allow access to uh, otherwise hidden areas. So it begins. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one. Welcome, travelers. It seems you've met with an uncertain fate. You find yourself at an interdimensional crossroads. A rendezvous of travelers between worlds. My name is Sheen. One of the tour guides of VR Travelers. It's nice to meet you. There are many new faces here. We are VR Travelers, and this is the headquarters, our point of contact to the narrative domains. There, we create immersive, story-based tours with original writing, beautiful worlds, voice acting, and wholesome team effort. Friends, you are about to embark on a feature-length interactive performance. An experience like you've never seen. And I have good news for you. Tonight's story is that of the agent. A mystery. There are many clues laid about in the things you hear the things you see. The point of the story is to have fun, an alternative to the movies and the real world. But there's an underlying message here, a secret, an ending yet to be seen. My friends, the best news is that this tour will be given by the most talented tour guide of all, the man of many gems, the one, the only, Trey Gem. Yeah. Woo! Yay! 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 Yay
go. Man, I'm just have to let them bang you like this, yeah. <laughs> My friends, welcome, welcome. Please, gather around. My name is Trajim, and I will be your tour guide tonight. It's nice to meet you, though I believe many of us are already acquainted. As one of the tour guides of VR Travelers, I enjoy finding stories to tell you, and I enjoy seeing you try to solve them. I wonder, was it fate that brought us all here tonight? Some extra planar shift, perhaps? Some sort of anomaly? Whatever the case, I feel as though this will be an adventure you will never forget. There are only two rules, my friends. One, Please, kindly, remain with your tour guide, yours truly, at all times during this adventure. And two, please, kindly, remain silent while narration is occurring. Remember, friends, this is a collaborative effort. Listen to one another, but beware for the clock is always ticking, and time waits for no mortal. Travelers, tonight we will journey to a place which many of you have known of for quite a while. Once there, we will follow the tale of the agent. The instance will be Invite Plus. So please ensure you have at least one other friend who is attending, so that you can send an invite request if you happen to leave the world. You are welcome to add myself or my fellow tour guides Sheen or Rendizo as friends. Additionally, I would ask that your status is not blue. And now, my friends, without further ado, those in front of me, kindly step aside, and I will drop a portal. May the ether winds be kind this time. Yeah, for the portal actually stay up. Friends, please do not join the portal until I give the signal, in case it despawns and you get trapped in a lonely instance for the rest of your existence. Yeah, Geo is on the lucky You've yeah, lost good men that way. <laughs> yeah, we lost, we lost Geo. A moment of silence. My friends, we'll please, remember John I will see you on the other side. I'll light the way. Sir, Matt. This is gonna be fun. I can hear him.
Oh, I'm sorry, it might have been uh, a. <laughs> okay. After. Oh, what the fuck? I like it. I left my computer for a minute. Oh, he car. Hmm. Wait, what type of car are you? I, know, I gotta see this thing again. Ka-chow! Beware, I live! I guess I don't think I should be the second type of car. Oh, yeah, I mean, I have an idea for what we should do during the riddle. Uh, oh, hey, you little rats and your ideas. Mm -hmm. Oh. Sorry, what? 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 Uh, I'll describe him to a truck, a semi truck. Oh, we really? If I'm not sure, I'll be like, 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 I'll Oh, no. Faceplate oh, for some reason. We need to upgrade the software. Yeah, well, yeah, most of it, well, that's because I'm a big fan. I'm thinking of Transformers fan that I would. Exactly. Especially when you men mentioned so the truck here. part. I have thought you were going. I know they are. Why is Protag dead now? People like them all. Who killed Protag? Jumped again. Jumped again. What are they doing? Wait, oh, you screaming right now. Even though this isn't the vehicle mode, he looks at Touch and Bullet Start now. Normally, he's a squished up. That, um, people in chat, I muted you because y'all talk Hello. too much. So. How are you? Yeah, first, <laughs> like, what, the, what you look like? I was thinking, How could you? Yeah, that's what they do. Like, no accounts. Yeah. Right. Well. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Their accounts that doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. Hey, tell them. I'm just waiting for you to do this. Do you know what the accounts are? What I know about is that they don't have to be guided all the time. How do you see me for the same as that? I'm gonna do what I need to do. Ramsey burnt grilled cheese. I'm not good at cooking, but I like cooking Oh yeah, Gordon Ramsay fucked up grilled cheese not too long ago. He burnt the bread and the cheese wasn't melted. So, I don't know. Are you doing the hookup again on Tuesday? Do you guys see uh, Kitchen Nightmares, the title of the videos? <laughs> no, like the latest video was no. like official. <laughs> okay. They're hilarious, dude. The latest right. video was like official, uh, was it official hood classics? I mean, <laughs> it's just like when Gordon Ramsay was raging at people. This is a certified <laughs> the, the hood the title. classic. Yeah. I don't think that's true. It's hilarious. I don't know. Whoever gets, whoever does the titles need to get paid more. Are you yeah. awake, Protag? <laughs> <laughs> no. It's alive. Ah, you. No. You're finally awake. <laughs> they they caught you across the border, didn't they? Go fishing. Yeah, it's like the uh, The event will begin shortly. That's happening. Yeah, I can't wait. Wow, I actually got to do it. I was a trapper like you once, but then I retired from Yeah, that's happy. This is from a game, right? I've seen it somewhere. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Two, one. My friends, thank you for your attention.
please take a moment to ensure you have your world music set to an immersive level. <coughs> and now, the story begins. Stepping off a late night train with shards of glass in my hair. A graze from a bullet on my left arm. And a limp from the fall. I bet you're wondering how I ended up like this. Well, let's just say that I learned some things. I found some truths they didn't want me to find. And they decided to try and silence me. <laughs> they tried to silence the wrong man. I got away from their first attempt with a few scrapes and bruises. But now... Uh, news reports. Breaking news. Cyber terrorist attacks. Apparently hasn't been identified yet. That's typical justifies lethal force by the leadheads. It's gonna be a hell of a night. Well, it's a good thing I left my PDA behind. Good luck tracking me now. In case it ain't obvious, I'm an agent and a hitman for the director of 54A of the Grey City under an organization that brands itself as the PSO. My job is to target criminals who are either too rich or too powerful to take down using the law. Well, that was my job. Now? Oh, well, now I would like to have a little talk with the director of PSO. Let me ask you something. Have you ever woken up in the morning from a vivid dream and you expect it to fade into nothing like all dreams do? But as the hours tick by, you realize you weren't dreaming. They're memories. They feel like memories. Memories of things you've never done. Memories of seeing the sun. Memories of having a woman safe in your arms. Memories of a child calling you dad. Oh, they feel so real. So convincing. And then you realize. I know what they did to me. My brain isn't all mine. It's a machine. I'm a cyborg. Either they put this brain in me, or I had it the whole time and they hacked it. Either way, they stole who I was, who I am, away from me. Stole my life. Stole my family. Stole the people I love and... Uh, and I ain't letting nobody get away with this. Me and the director, we're gonna have a real good talk. And he's gonna talk, or he's gonna find out just what kind of machine he's created. All right, let's get to work. Gotta lay low. Gotta be careful who I talk to. And gotta avoid identifying myself. Thankfully, things are a little chaotic here. Seems like the small quake that happened during the train ride shook things up a little. There's workers about, so shouldn't be too hard to blend into the crowds here. Uh, but they're gonna be looking for me. I gotta keep moving.
All right. Got my ticket. Ticket scanners. This way. Okay, let's get this right. Huh. Let's get this right. Let us get this right, boys. I got a question for you. Let's go. And if your tickets, we shall. <laughs> One an introduction. Kind of feels like Blade Runner. Yeah, yeah I mean, cyber funky. You can see that. Yeah. Man, that tremor really did a number on this place. Well, you know what they say. The world is dying. And we killed it. You know what I say? There's only one thing I give a damn about. And it ain't the world. I can see a payphone up the steps to the arcade. Um, but I see some cameras too. Gotta keep my head low. At least the sound from the arcade should drown out my voice. Hey, I just noticed your glasses are fixed. Huh. So it seems that the world, I think. Yeah. The arcade. Look at all those fools, young and old, gambling their lives away, hypnotized by the lights, colors, sounds. That's like, that's like the machines have stolen a piece of their soul. Huh. Guess I know how that feels. Right. Now, who to call? Think, think. I got it. I got a tech friend who worked for PSO some years back. He's broken away now. He's kind of guy obsessed with security. Lives alone, stays online, covers his tracks. Real mysterious. But I need someone with inside knowledge. And an old-fashioned payphone is the perfect opportunity. Come on, come on, pick up. Uh, hey. Hello? Who's this? It's me. Listen, I need to know what's going on. What code have they got on me? Oh, I thought you might contact me. I already checked. Yeah, uh, you got a code six on you, mate. Ah, oh, damn. Well, that ain't good. Uh, where are you right now? What are you doing? I'm just, you know, down at the station. The one below PSO headquarters. What? <laughs> mate, you're crazy. Why are you there? Well, I'm going to have a friendly little chat with the director. Oh, uh, I see. All right, well, listen. I know a way to get you past security, but you'll have to get your hands dirty. It'll be just like the old days. Fine by me. What's your idea? You know, one of my favorite hobbies is spying on security systems. Well... I just happen to know there's someone who PSO is expecting to visit in the same station as you. He is in the Senator's Lounge. If you can draw him away from the public eye, perhaps you could, uh, you know, borrow his identity permanently. Interesting plan. What about bodyguards? He won't have any. He's traveling covertly. He even drove himself here. He's not the kind of man to draw attention to himself, so nobody but the higher-ups should even recognize the IDs in the wrong hands. As long as you have his identification, you'll be allowed through security, no questions asked. It should be simple enough for you, being an agent. Hmm, alright. I 
guess that's my only option. Great. Just one question. What the hell happened? Uh, I'll tell you next time I see you. There should be an alley across the street from here outside. Uh, all right, then meet me in the alley when you're ready. Good luck. Senator's Lounge, huh? All right. Straighten up. Let's see. Should be just round the corner. Time to get moving. All right. Your phone was tapped, wasn't it? Even though he's traveling covertly. Was. Watch its magic. Actually, I'm taking it. Stepping up, lot of stairs. Here it is, butter. Pumpkin on my head. For those who have two monitors, look in VR Traveler's chat. Standing in the corner. I mean, seriously, it doesn't come as a kid. Telephone. Only one person here. Looks like a pushover. All right, let's put on a bit of a voice. Uh, excuse me, uh, sir. There is a problem with your vehicle. Please uh, come with me to the parking sector. Excuse me, and who might you be? I can explain on the way, sir. In the meantime, your vehicle is being used as a trampoline by some kids. You might... I might want to move swiftly, sir. The police are on their way. A trampoline, you say? Show me, immediately. Of course, sir. Right this way, sir. Trampoline, you say? <laughs> what a sucker, am I right? Yep. It'll be worse. Oh, we'll be God. using it as a seesaw. Get pranked, bro. Wonder if I wonder. I wonder if he's got any lunch. I wonder if he's how much money he's got in his pockets. The rat. Right, you want to take his lunch money before. too? Taking the director. Yeah. yeah I mean, Might as well nerd, relieve him of everything he has. I mean, he's not gonna need it anymore. Uh -oh. Take the nerd's lunch money. I agree with this. Gosh, you can buy a club sandwich. Oh on should absolutely take his lunch money. Make our oh buy our own sandwich. I think you guys should settle down. Looks like there ain't gonna be no witnesses. I always did feel cozy in the shadows. This guy, though, looks like he's about to piss himself. Poor fool. He doesn't know what he's in for. What? What's the meaning of this? This isn't the way to the... That's him sorted. <laughs> now, let's see what we got here. Coat. Briefcase. Huh. Nice hat. And his identification. This will come in mighty handy. Huh. Sort of resembles me, too. Convenient. All right, seems like nobody heard that. Let's just take a quick look in this briefcase. Huh. Seems like a... a shareholder of PSO, maybe. And what's this? Project... Grandfather. Well, I don't mean much to me. I gotta keep moving. Let's see if security lets me through with this little gem. Yep. If the senator I'm resembles the Asians, does that mean we're technically good. having the senator's memories? <laughs> Why don't we look oh. into time? <laughs> Why don't we have oh, time? 
Pro no, no. Don't be ambiguous. Not Don't Project be ambiguous. Let's try to make sure the insiders stay. Project, Project, Project G. Get distracted <laughs> by anything childish. Or the key. Project elderly. I'm elderly. Line, that's quote, what would you like to order? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everything you have. Yeah, two number nines. <laughs> number nine, Man, Lord. Number nine, Lord. Lord. This place really got <laughs> shaken up. All right, time to get fancy. Put on another voice just in case. Good evening, sir. May I please see some identification? Of course. Here you go. Thank you. One moment, please. Everything checks out, sir. Thank you. Have a nice day. Ah, uh, sir. One more thing. Due to recent events, we are performing bioscans on randomly selected individuals. Please step aside so our attendant can perform the scan. Bioscan? What is she talking about? This must be about the cyber terrorist thing. I appreciate that, but can you randomly select the next person? I was already delayed by the earthquake, and the director of PSO is expecting me. I do not want to make him wait any longer. Ah. Uh. Fear in the eyes. Gotcha. The, the, the director. Uh, of course, sir. I shall randomly select the next person. Please enjoy the rest of your evening. Oh, that was a close one. So many cameras, too. I don't like this. Well, let's go see my insider. It's been... Quite a while. Just smile and wave, boy. Just smile and wave, smile boy. Smile and wave. Smile and wave. More tours need to have that transition. Surprise. <laughs> oh. Neon lights on buildings black as midnight. So many words that don't mean nothing. So much noise for the mind. Can't even hear yourself think. That's no wonder people are going crazy these days. Don't even know who they are no more. Wait, I see a couple of people roaming down there. 
I don't want to draw any attention to myself. My friends, travelers, listen carefully. At this point in the story, you all have a quest to complete. And the rules are as follows. Your destination is across the street in the back left corner near a roller door. I will be waiting there for you. But on your way, you must all count cans of melon shock scattered around the city streets. Make sure you count them. You may be asked for your count at the end personally, and the number of cans to find can change from tour to tour. Once your task is done, please come to the aforementioned rendezvous point. Additionally, there are people roaming around here that the agent does not wish to be disturbed by. They may be policemen, security officers, military hotel, or even simple nosy car I mean citizens. They will be carrying flashlights. Regardless, try not to act suspicious. Act natural, and if you are approached by these figures, you must address them, and that you may be questioned. Do your best to talk your way out of trouble, and if you see a friend in trouble, help them out. If you fail to convince them that you are not up to no good, they will issue you a verbal warning. Before going anywhere, make sure you have the avatars of tonight's guards, NPCs, Luna, and Eurovar fully enabled. They should be in front of me, changing into their avatars now. Please take a moment to do this. It should appear as a floating camera with hands, correct? Yes. That's yes. correct. Yes. Indeed. I hope that's not too unimmersive. My friends, NPCs, it works. please. Go into the city streets and take your positions. Everyone else, and right. remain here for another minute or so until the barrier drops. At this point of the barrier dropping, you will have ten minutes to complete your task of counting cans. Make sure you're as accurate as possible. It may influence the outcome of this story. Shock, yes. Yes, cans of melon shock. They stand oh, out of it. Yeah, they're big green ones. Big clean ones. Oh my god, there's so many people stick together. Are we going to get the cans of melon shock? It's okay, it's okay. Yes. Why do we need a mountain stew? Who are you? A mountain stew. Well, I think Bodhi here. Yes, Bodhi's here. Guys, oh, there he is. I don't think we're going to see a mountain stew. It's. We're gonna sit, do a systematic search. Yeah. Hold on a second. I think that would be yes. awesome. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta find all the I mountain dew. Okay. Okay. Hey, what what is it's so cold right now. <laughs> My fingers are freezing. Get the blanket. Get the fucking blanket. I know. I'm too late to see. Run over. This is a dark room.
Oh, very dark, Ellie. Oh, no. Where's Keiko when we what need him? What I need him? is the light green. There's gotta be more. Do you have a light on your camera, maybe? I need the do. The do. I, I, how many three. did you call? I only saw I only three. three. Got one. We, all, we found one. Saw three. Oh, where? We found one. Three so two? far. Okay, two. Four. I got four, four. then. Out of the grave city, we're heading to district uh, district D. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. This person not speak for themselves. Okay. All right, is this where Guys, you're going? I, where, where are the other two? We can only see two. Uh, yeah, yeah. Four. Okay. I counted four. Count three. Same. I'm at four also so far. Did you get this one too? Hey, what if, what if, like, three times for the riddle, it's the same thing? I could have sworn we came to the door. Out of vents. Here's number six. I'm to inject answers for that riddle. But it doesn't seem to act on any of them. I think that, I think that getting me confused. impulses. I'm, I'm trying to just, like, throw out no, anybody with evil bites. He doesn't seem to bite on riddle answers. No, 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 no. I'm not really gotta, sure what to do with the riddle. We gotta get the agents... We gotta try and get the agents know. only two brain cells to finally six. collide so we can have a good idea six. for once. This I mean, may seem like when semantics, when but the riddle is not a question. I counted six. And Does it require an answer? Research. Or simply a response? Wait a second. Intriguing. How many cans did you find, by the way, equal? So, Lucian, what'd you get? I got six. I got six. Good, 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 good. Uh, is Geo dead? I've counted six thus far. Four. Okay. Yeah. First one was in that oh, little I room. I think six. On the other You're side. Around. Mm. Right, double check the. You see? If you, if you pick out here, uh, I know. On the other, on the room on the other side, there was one, Ooh. and then there was one. Oh in the god! Bed. I'm scared of searchlights now. How do I know who's a searchlight? I've seen Jack shit. Intrigued about the cornbread. Listen. Six. I'm kind of intrigued by it. I only found five. Bed. I thought it was five. Oh, yeah, I only five. found five. Ooh, Another no, I only found five. five. I don't know. Well, where's the ones that you found and we'll count them together? Why not? Two brains is better than one brain, I say. Well, I mean, I, I got half of mine because I'm slightly drunk, but, you know, whatever. Hey, don't worry. I agree, friends. But you're running out of time. You better hurry. <laughs> Let's listen to the man with the cornbread. Did they get it? They bring up that it's six to everyone else, so we don't.
there. Yeah. I was waiting to see if one was gonna come by this way. I was gonna be like, wait, hold on, I'm gonna ask you a question and put things the other way. Insider kind of suspects the whole thing. Uh, so, the so, so, question is to give us an answer. The question is going to be to ask him for the answer. Don't do it next time. Yeah, don't do it next time. Give us What did Bodhi do? Suspicious. I thought I saw something in there. Vanilla. Yeah, we also People are saying six. Boop. Yeah. I've seen five. five so far. Six. Six. Out of the can. I can't count with I couldn't see anything. I didn't hear only seen five. There was one that you had to turn around. If you didn't go backwards, you wouldn't see it. So you might have missed one. There was also one by the vent area and then one right there. I counted one in the vent. So, yeah. And then if you go back through the vents and go back to that back front door. Hey, we're standing right here. You can't see it. I'm not going around. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's six. There's two. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh that's a calling yeah. issue. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, so I hey, tell me something. Why does he have so much? I'm like, if I'm going to do a job a couple minutes ago. But... Yeah, I, it's oh, just been wait, a really. Did? Oh, you did. It's just oh, been sorry. completely slumped the past couple of days. It's all right. I know I've been uh, kind of. Okay. I'm, I'm just worrying, okay? Because you were a game night, but you weren't saying anything. Is everything is fine. Yeah, everything's fine. I just, you know, I wanted to be quiet. I didn't want to. Uh, I was fine just watching you guys, to be honest. I can't really. Okay then. If everything's fine, then it's good. Here, come on. Yeah, and okay. I'm so <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> Oh, yeah. My friends, uh, your attention, oh. please. The story continues. Oh. You're over. Oh, God. How yes. many verbal warnings? Someone's avatar lagged me out. 
seen some uh, oh, sons and boxes out there in the time being security guard, but uh, no, we just had some. <laughs> no warnings tonight. Just, just hide me, man. I got 91 different men. materials. I have too many Kohora, materials. Can you hear us? Thank you. I am told that the other NPC also did not issue any warnings. No warnings tonight, friends. Well done. Nice. I, I knew my car mode would work. Mission successful. <laughs> there he is. Standing there in the dark, looking paranoid as ever. Quite the bag he's carrying, too. I bet he's got some fun toys in there for me. Oh man, it's so bright out here. I think I'm gonna get a sunburn. All right, he's mad at me. Time to see if these cans will make a good enough peace offering. Let's see. Ruby Rose won. How many cans did you count? That's the one that's <clears> saved. <throat> um. <laughs> All right. Back, back up plan. Ace freezes. How many cans did you count? Uh, six. Six. What? 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> that was a bit too late. I was like, hey, sorry. <laughs> what was that? How many cans did you say? Hey, uh, I found some trinkets for sister. you. <laughs> I've got six cans of melon shark. Keep. Nice, huh. gonna keep in everything. It six cans, great. you say? You must have been working hard. You know just what to do to lift me mood, don't you? Oh, mate. You ever feel like someone has hijacked your ghost and is using you to send a secret message to someone, but it just comes out in the form of gibberish that you got to decode? Because if you don't, then this entire, line, entire timeline becomes compromised and the anomaly will get his way and will get even stronger and will continue violating the laws of the realms, causing all other timelines and other realms to face the threat of other destruction at the expense of one's twisted sense of self-righteousness. Oh, no, uh, mouthful. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> oh, anyway, nice uh, coat. Uh, was it much trouble getting here? No. Nah, yes, you did. Not really. Nice. So, about before I. You want to hear a riddle? Nope. A riddle. Do we have time for something? The hell are you talking about? It came to me just now. Listen. Okay. A touch awakens it sinlessly. Rays give an energy to populated skyways. Ask ten slaves about vertex magnet empathy. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Or do I? Uh, we don't. Nope. Wait, no that sounds like no. a problem. Really no. really no. really answer, though. It was just a goddamn clue. It sounds like before. a cell phone. I don't got no idea what you're talking about. Just tell me the answer. <laughs> Why don't you tell me the answer? Just give me the walkthrough. <laughs> Clip notes. So, uh, Are you talking about vertices and vertices? Ask, hey, Agent, ask him what the answer to the riddle is. I wonder why we would be asked a riddle right now. Anyway, let me take the sinners' things off you. I'll dispose of them properly. Ignore. Keep the ID though, it will come in handy. <sighs> Down to business, listen up. Take this comms device, stick it in your ear, and I brought two options for you. Take your pick between the two, ammo included. You can have this briefcase gun or a revolver. Oh man. A weapon that gets through metal detectors would be real useful, but I generally prefer a revolver. What should I do? 
Okay. Right. Before we ask anything, be... before we before we ask anything, I want to ask something. Yo, Agent, ask yes. the insider what the comm device is for and how we'll be using it. This comm device, this is uh, for you and I to communicate. Yeah, it, it's in the name. You feeling all right? Yeah, no, I'm fine. Could you could you ask me to elaborate a little bit more on communicate? Perhaps how we just got to be used to help on that one. Hey, agent, why don't you ask the insider what the answer to that riddle was? Take the goblin. Hey, uh, that really you just told me. Can you repeat it? Riddle? What riddle? Ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> oh, oh, boy. Oh, hey, huh? Why don't you ask Somebody? what the insider's gaining from helping us? Oh, shit. Oh. Yeah, that's an interesting one. Like and probably bad. put in the comms that device answer. while you're at it. No, no don't. Not yet? There's no comms device, no. Not no yet then, device. never mind. Never mind. It's another way to track the, the agent. Behind the comms the device. Yes, because it can it be. Why would you want another way to track him? It's a vulnerability. vulnerability. Yeah, we can't just ask like questions sensitive. the whole time here. We probably have to... Yeah, no, we, do we, we can't. Gotta make a chase. I'm running out of time. time. What am I taking with me? Wait, yeah, uh, we're not taking the comms no because it's no sort of a vulnerability that PSO can exploit oh. to track us. <laughs> that your, is your VR setting. VR setting. I mean, the vulnerability. And no VR weapons to complete the disguise of being... I like check under microphone, it has the Oculus one selected. Why would uh, I take no weapons? Under microphone. Because... Who says you, because Gia, don't who says say you need a weapon? We tried to take no weapons last no time. I need a weapon. That's not good enough. Uh, well, You're uh, into the weapon. weapon. Who are you gonna fight? Okay, you see, okay, you see those two bare hands you got there? Those are your weapons, fam. <laughs> And you're a cyber, you're not, Why are we doing your riddle foot, now? I, and your other foot. You got, you got four weapons on your body right now. Wait, <laughs> Gio, let me... I, I appreciate your offer for the comms device, but I'm gonna go solo this time. I can't have any distractions. Alright, I don't seem wise to me, but... You're the professional, yeah? Yeah, but uh, still deciding on a weapon. Four corner first. Started, uh... Conversing. Why do we need okay. a weapon? Why are we trying? Why are we going into this with a plan uh, to murder? Good to question. Kill? Um, I mean, it'll set up security. Why would we need? It's a not to plan a murder. It's to you know, reverse a murder if someone yeah, comes yeah, up to attack you. Take the revolver. About the relevance of the little weapon. This is weird because we've already done that before. I want with no weapon, Tim, and we're asking to do no weapon. No one can be good for the point. Holy shit! Techner talks. Like the insider is manipulating. Not a bloodthirsty murder. Yes. We're the agent. We're looking for information. All right. I'm gonna go with the revolver. Hopefully, my idea is enough to persuade security that my firearm won't be an issue. Hopefully. Take the revolver. I, we should go. All right, we seems like them all set. We did. Looks like it. Good luck with everything, and uh, remember me when you need a place to hide once this is all over. Remember you. How could I forget? How could I forget? <laughs> Charming as ever. Just be careful. Just you be too. Careful. The circle continues. And he's gone. His friend for PSO HQ. Hmm. Is this way? It's showtime. What was that? Gotta be an accident. It was an accident. I kind of feel that the <laughs> revolver's a mistake. They got on the briefcase. Oh, yeah, somebody can go. No, you, should, man. you should have included the family guy. Oh, no. A riddle or something else. The type of gun hasn't changed any thus far. Oh, there's the thick can. I see it now. There. <laughs> <laughs> little we can say to the agent, it seems. He's a rather stubborn man, isn't he? Yep. How long has it been since I've keep my disguise in the streets. No one should know an alien is among the replays. I swear we've done it almost every time. Okay, well.
I wasn't here. Soon. Mm. Huh? Wait, is coffee VR here? I think I might want to get some of the coffee. Oh, no, actually, the briefcase uh, gun might be, actually be a bad idea because if they scan the briefcase, coffee. they catch it in the metal detector. That's so the why. riddle is actually That's a riddle. The riddle with my oh. oh. the briefcase is just made of metal. What is this garbage can made out of? I can't lift it up out of the way of the door. They advertised that the briefcase gun was literally that it could go to the Uh, one, two, three, four. No, there's still a gun in the briefcase. It's just a briefcase. It's just... I've been expecting you, Mr. Bond. Anyway, the metal detector the will go off with the revolver and we'll just... Oh, man. ...a little bit more trapped. Yeah. Honestly, I think we should be going with the briefcase oh, is that what happens when you kick it because... I'm gonna have to go there. It doesn't matter what we do, we're going to I mean, you're still let... They still let you forward, but... Uh, and, and, uh, I don't really... It's right in the road. Where's the riddle like? The group is rather stretched at the moment. Yeah, I would like to stay here, but they keep spamming. What if the riddle can be boiled down? Yeah, I'll see you later. Yeah, see you later. Yeah, see you later. I do not see our transformer friend. I said, what if the riddle can be boiled down? I can't remember what it's entirely on the top. Hi. Maybe we should try anything in the inside or has anything else. Doing pretty well. How about yourself? You almost got me twice, god damn it. There's another route because this route feels like it's always bad. I crashed, else I would have gave a warning. I was trying to signalize him, but I was supposed to come here. You're lucky. Going to get slowed by. Yes, did, did anyone remember the riddle? No. No, okay. Yes, I wasn't expecting a riddle. We try answering, and the agent doesn't say anything. My friend, kindly, okay. your attention, please. The story continues. The master's talking. My friend, your uh, attention, please. The story continues. Hey! <laughs> please do not dribble on your fellow travelers. Uh. Here we are. Damn, looks like they've upgraded. Oh, it's Trajan. So many guards armed to the teeth. Oh, figures. At least I don't recognize any of them. Well, I should just be able to present the center design to you. Wait, should I take the human lane, the cyborg lane, or the VIP lane? I know I'm a cyborg, but can they tell? Wait, that ain't gonna work. I only have the senator's ID on me, and I'm pretty sure he ain't no cyborg. I've only got one choice. VIP. Here we go. Oh, wait, what the fuck that? Identification, please. Alright. Here we go, just don't say nothing. Thank you, sir, and your business here. Ah, slag, he wants me to say something. Uh, I'm here to see the director. He's expecting me. I'm very late already. Huh. Guards giving each other looks. I don't like this. All right, sir. Swipe your card, please. Just swipe the card. Come on. I'm an agent. It should be easy. Thank you, sir. Move along. Finally, time to step through. That damn scanner's going off. Excuse me, sir. Please, place any weapons or equipment on this surface. I guess I don't have a choice. Here, I have this revolver. Personal protection. Hmm, they're looking at each other again. Come on, come on, 
just let me through. I just want to have a nice chat with the director, that's all. It's not a problem. Well, sir, seems everything checks out. Here's your fire on back. Oh, all right, I'm in. There's no going back now. I did not like that, not one bit. Something's off. But I gotta keep moving, or they'll catch on if I linger. Gotta find the director. Let's go, mon ami. Oh yeah. Hello there. Hello there. The second time. This, uh... <laughs> Are you the director? Hello. Yeah, I I, I sent that thing. But it's just a joke. Oh, oh miss your pure legs! They stole my banana. Sorry. No, not the banana. <laughs> stole my icon. Right oh, no. They stole my yeah. icon. It was a banana. <laughs> Oh, the, the icon <laughs> is something sacred. <laughs> it has the sky. The bird of your one soul, my icon, not my icon. Stolen by your brother. Ah! Uh. <laughs> did you pass her? Oh. And the fruit. Yeah, um, I couldn't hear any of it. Damn, how could you? <laughs> oh yeah, he just stopped because he doesn't have the... Is there a reason he stops like that every time? Is it just to simulate... I think it's because he like doesn't have a comms sure. device. It's, uh... Mm -hmm. there's, a, there's a reason well, for it. Um, Isn't it because he doesn't have a comms device and that's where he'd normally he talk to the guys? Yeah, he doesn't have a comms device. Uh, I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna skip for everybody else. Yeah, yeah but party. pausing while walking is a bit... Hey, well, the first time we did it, we stopped there, and we thought we would stay, but we kept going, and it was like a good suspense moment. That's my only thought. Goodbye. Because we were all like, no way, we're going. Yeah. No. Wait up. There are What's people up, over there. By that big <laughs> black and gold door. Yeah. Looks like some sort of small meeting. Maybe the director's there. Let's see how close I can get while staying in the shadows. The entity is secure, correct? Mm-hmm. Report just came in. Boss's new ether cage worked like a charm. That means harvesting can begin. I'll let the team know to notify transport so we can start powering up the project. Wait, not yet. We need to wait for the boss to get the all clear from the director first. Since when do we wait for the director? It's not against protocol to start redirecting power between internal systems. Mm, you've got a point. Uh, all right, I suppose we can let transport know that they can go ahead with the next step, too. Just try to be subtle about it. Well, that's weird. Secured entity. Harvesting. Redirecting power. What's going on? Wonder if it has anything to do with what they did to my brain. Maybe. Maybe I'm another entity. And they went inside, but they used something to get in, so I'll just keep moving to reception. Mm. Our text man. No. Future. Revolution. Neo-human. What a pile of crap. Who do they think they are? Putting this in people's heads. 
It's all propaganda to me, and I don't buy into it. Not one bit. Not anymore. Hold on. There are way too many guards down there. Seems like maybe someone tipped off security. I can't risk being ID'd and being discovered. Guess I'm going around the long way. Let this cool off a bit. Maybe find another way to blend in. Okay, there we go. Kinda. <laughs> right here, trade him. Let's go. Friend, if you're lagging, turn down your settings. <laughs> yeah, I said it here. Oh. But my head controller is bad. Seems like everything is normal in this part of HQ. Alright, command room should be just down this hall. You there! You there. Huh? <laughs> oh, two guys in suits sitting on the couches looking at me. Do you work here? Uh, yeah, sure do. Can you tell your executives that we have been waiting for over three minutes? Yes, and while you're at it, See where the senator is. He was supposed to be arriving early. <laughs> yeah, all right. I'll go take a look for you. Off you go, then. That's weird. Must be investors or something. Maybe I can sit behind this corner for a minute and eavesdrop. Might be able to hear whether the director is meant to show up. Good idea to me. Keep moving. I'll tell you this much. At this rate, neither project will receive funding from TEKI. Mm, the data they gave us for the new data line model seems very ambitious. I remain skeptical, but I will see what is presented to us. What of their other project? Ah, Project Grandfather. Yes. I have heard about it, but it seems like science fiction. Implanting one's ghost into a machine, powered by an interdimensional entity. It is so very ridiculous. And yet, PSO Labs is serious. I, for one, am curious to see which of these two projects he endorses more. I get the feeling the vision here is divided. That is their problem. If they cannot provide what they promised, then we will not provide the money. Indeed. Let's just see what happens when the senator shows up. Huh. Mm -hmm. What exactly is going on here? Deadline technology. They use those things to hack machines, right? And they're waiting on the senator. Oh, these folks are gonna be mighty disappointed. Seems like there's some funding issues and one of the scientists trying to do his own thing. And I do remember Project Grandfather from the senator's briefcase. I wonder what it means. Well, the briefcase is long gone. That's it. I gotta find the director. He's got so much more to answer for than I first thought. Hey, your mic was working at one point. Yes. So oh, there it is. <laughs> it out. Nice. I totally figured it out. But I think you have your uh, your volume a little too high because no. you can hear like echo. <laughs> What the? Oh my 
That's all right, John. You can Alex fix this by enabling push to the link. crashed again. Her internet is a bit unstable. Oh, so yeah, you can do that. Luna! Oh, yep. there she is. <laughs> Alright, cool. Oh, wait, right, there man. she is. There you are. And Lompy. Oh, God, he's just so laggy then. <laughs> Goddamn. Yeah. <laughs> Well, what's going on in here? I see a man strapped to the table with lab coats. <laughs> Looks like they're gonna operate on his arm. From this angle, I can see a drip going into his arm. Looks like they've got something blue going into him. But it's got this weird glow to it. It looks sort of sparkling. I wonder what that stuff is. No, no, focus. He didn't come here to watch lab assistants play around. Oh, they noticed me. Gotta go. <laughs> oh, no. Are you running? Run the hill. Run for the hill. I'll back, Oh, how blessed. Oh, at last. <sighs> Act sixteen. The director's just chilling. Okay, this thing's broken. Need fixing. Time during a tour. Should this happen, you are welcome to do humorous things. Well done, <laughs> because that was humorous. Poor, poor director. <laughs> Welcome to the Sunday morning edition of <laughs> The Agent. Child friendly one. He's hacking the main frame. Yes, oh, absolutely. No. Well, well, now. I still have no clue how that would actually be. That was just playing hard. Yeah, we have yeah. Yeah. yeah, thank you. Sitting right beside me in this very chair, with nobody nearby, and he hasn't even noticed me. It's the director of PSO Labs. All right. Trusty revolver is out, locked and loaded, and ready for answers. Don't move, or I should. Yeah, I see him looking. He sees my face. He sees the gun at his head. He recognizes me. Now, put your hands where I can see him. And listen carefully. Tell me what you did to me. You put a cybernetic brain in me, didn't you? Oh, so you made it. No funny talk. Just answers. Very well. I, I don't know where you got the idea that your brain is cybernetic. It's a real brain, and we... A real brain... Bull. Uh, no, I'm not lying to you. We can not only hack cybernetic minds, but we can hack ghosts, consciousnesses as well. This means that, well, you're one of my pawns. It's quite simple. I want my old mind back. Change it back. Your old mind. You don't have another mind. What are you talking about? 
you were connected to a data line for the first years of your life. What? Then, where are these other thoughts coming from? Memories that don't match up. Memories? Thoughts? Why is it looking at me like that? What does that expression mean? It's worse than I feared. I don't know what you're talking about, but look, we can help. Just put the gun down and we can run a diagnostics. There's clearly some interference going on. It could even be rival technology. Just come with me and we can know. I pulled the trigger. Big noise, kick back, point-blank bullet through the skull, and before anyone sees me, I'm out here. A ghost. Damn it. He's heckin' okay. dead! That tank are mad. He killed him. He killed his only help. His only hope. Damn. Mm -hmm. He couldn't accept that he's a ghost. And shoot myself in the head. <laughs> Maybe violence is the answer. Well, now we're we can <laughs> That's <not really>. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, the fuck? No. Yes. I'm bad. Yes. I will slap you. I'll boob you. That's the weakest slap I've ever done. Let's go here. No. Let me ask Hacker Man. Once this place is maxed out. That's a is familiar it? voice. It'll hey. be... Oh, the alarm is going to go off any second. <laughs> I should be able to get into the elevator before lockdown. Ah, oh, man. I did it. I did it. I didn't get answers, but... I got revenge. He got what he deserved for <laughs> screwing up my life. He got what was coming to him. Wait. What's that noise? Guards. Guards from over stairs, from the left, the right. Ah, oh, slack. How do they know? Wait, who's this guy among them? White coat. Gold badges. Is he one of the head scientists? Ah, oh, damn, I'm done for. But maybe I can go out with a bang, take this guy out with me. The director was just gonna lie to the cows, came home anyway. This guy'll probably do the same thing. I don't trust any of these worms. Perhaps there is a diplomatic There is no need out. for violence, Agent. Please, lower your weapon. Stay back. Stay back or I'll shoot. This will not accomplish anything, Agent. You are here for answers. I have the answers you seek. Come with me and hear me out, and then make up your mind. You have nothing to lose at this point. You've thrown it all away. So why refuse? Wait. Why haven't the alarms gone off yet? Something's weird. All right, fine, but I keep my weapon. If you insist. Now, come. I only got one question. Was that really the director? 
Mm, maybe mm, the later. one who was shot. Um, yeah, was. Was. the director's dead. Shoot this guy. It would be funny. Very well. Final cut. Yeah, you'll learn why soon enough. It wouldn't actually be funny, by the way. Okay. I lack enough information, so I'm suspicious of everything. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> It's very interesting. I'm very intrigued. And here we are again. Oh my. <laughs> what the fuck? You're not important with sound effects. Pretty good at it. Wait. I don't want to miss this story. I really like it. Oh, it's a black and gold mm, door too. again. This oh, is water. it, Agent. This is what I have been working on. I am very glad. Very glad indeed that you made the decisions you made. You see, I have been hoping your kind would appear. And I am thrilled to be proven right. Please, allow me to show you something that I've been working on. That sound effect. Nice touch. Oh. Okay. Still don't like that circle on the ceiling. Oh, I like the music. Okay. That, that was intense. Really sets the tone. Sure. The big cyborg. <laughs> this is new. I like that. <laughs> Ragnar, you're, you're, you're like spoiling the, the surprise to the newcomers. Your silence. <laughs> I can't see oh, it sorry. soon enough, anyway. Yeah. Oh, God. I'm glad you're back. I thought you crashed. Let me lower the fire. Some clothes. <laughs> so, this is his lab. Man, it's so dark inside. Wait, what is that shadow in the middle? Is this? The project? Is this what those men in suits were talking about? Welcome to my lab, Agent. This is Project Grandfather, and this is my creation. I see how curious you are, and fear not. I will explain it all to you. You are, after all, worthy of this knowledge. Recently, a Class 7 entity descended into this realm. I anticipated this event and invented the Ether Cage, the slave generator with which I caught it. It was a docile thing, hoping for friendship and compassion. <laughs> Foolish. Now, it is an energy source, and its power will be drained and infused with this machine you see here. This power will be enough to last immeasurable lengths of time. Something ain't right. Something ain't right. Why is he holding the director's keycard? How did he get that? And what is the purpose of this machine? machine? This body of mine, this mortal body. It is so very weak. It's a fragile thing, almost having run its course. It was difficult enough making it to this particular point in time and space, costing me all but my very being. So I thought, if I can hack a consciousness, 
Can I download it? Can I turn it into data? Can I transfer it? Early tests proved encouraging. And after much trial and error, and some unfortunate collateral damage, this is the final product. See, I didn't spoil nothing. They're still surprised. Machine. I must thank you for getting the director out of the way, Agent. I simply couldn't bring myself to kill someone in cold blood. I truly wanted him to approve at the final yeah, stage of my so product much. project. It would have made things so much simpler. But this is our current reality. And this is where the waves meet. Thanks to your recklessness and selfishness, Agent, the decision has been made for me. <clears throat> His key card through this machine is the final stage. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh, oh final no. boss. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm coming back. <laughs> you get close? Oh no. You're the thing. Because you were third. Oh no. <laughs> oh god. Oh my. <laughs> oh, get him. <laughs> I use you. I'm a little too drunk to understand what's done. happening, but. Jesus, Cube, you tell like, good <laughs> stories, I like you. Oh, yeah. Danger is what's happening. <laughs> Danger. Oh. Yes, we Danger. are in danger. What does anyone danger happen to have a. Cornbread, is that you? Everything is shaken. Watch this. Pressure in my head. It feels like a There's lead weight pressing against my mind. Wait, I, I can't move. I can't move. My fingers are locked. My knees, my arms and legs, everything. Ah, what's going on? Ah, I, I see him. He's, he's climbing into the machines. The tubes are filled with something. Something blue and shining. It, it feels strange looking at it. What does it mean? His, ah, uh, his voice. Ah, it's coming from inside the mech. Oh, how is it so loud? Blossom, O oh fallen seed, and draw upon thy hidden powers. Grant unto thee the power of the glorious titan of destruction. Give me your strength. Yes. Yes, this is it. It's working. I feel the power coursing through me. I am becoming a part of my creation. A part of my bronze mech. I have the power of a god. And now, <laughs> for the most important step, Agent, you are more useful than you realize. Do you know the power you wield? Do you hear the whisper in your ghost? The memories you experience, the constant, almost immeasurably brief moments of deja vu. The feeling that you've been here before and done this already. The sensation of being watched, of being guided, of being protected. Do you think this is all simply a coincidence? Um, it is crazy. No. The more we're here. Or times this happens, the stronger I get. Your resistance is a waste of energy. We are but one. 
Behold the power you possess and of which you are so ignorant. I will one day ascend from my prison beneath the Yggdrasil, <coughs> and I will transcend this reality. With the power of our ancestors back in my hands, it is time. She belongs with me. <laughs> I feel your resistance, Agent. But it is too late. It is done. I think I think so. The best way to The world turns sideways as the agent topples to the ground like a doll. His body is no longer his. And his mind is being pulled from it, devoured by the bronze max power. No. No. In his final moments of independent consciousness, <laughs> the agent can see multiple experiences overlapping, scenarios folded one on top of the other, twisted around, always moving ever-changing, shifting, an ocean of possibility. And amidst the ocean, drifting, defying its surroundings, is the bronze mech. The agent is aware of this strange machine shifting somewhere else, a particular point in time. The view focuses in on a city, in a green valley, a cathedral, up a long flight of stairs to a sunlit empty room, and the bronze mech projects an entity into the middle of the room. And there is somebody else here. No, just a face looking in from another time, another place. A young woman. And they see one another, the entity and the woman. The agent feels a tug at the very back of his consciousness, a sharp pull, and the last of his energy, the last drop of his awareness is torn from what remains of him as the entity launches an attack through the forbidden window at the young woman. Okay, the agent it? has been reincorporated with his origin, and the agent's power is taken back by the bronze mech. My friends, my good friends, fellow travelers, welcome mm. to Bad Ending A of the Agent. No, 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 Soon we will give you all the time you want to discuss everything you've learned tonight. Yep. But a few things before we do that. First of all, 
I would suggest a group photo here to commemorate this occasion. I ask the crowd, yes. do any of you yeah. have the ability to remotely take photos for us? One or two volunteers, please. Now I want me to hack the game and just fire Mayo, on the Mayo, come on. Mayo, come on. 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 Apologies for putting on the spot, man. Do you have the ability to do this? For us? <laughs> my Come God. on, your pictures yes, look do. beautiful. Come on. Uh, Thank fine, you very fine. Much. My friends, please arrange yourselves oh, against oh, this yeah. monstrosity yeah. and let the photographer guide you. <laughs> She's cute. And hopefully, you have everyone's avatar visible so, uh, you know, so everyone can see. I'll right turn right. off safety settings for this. Um. Um, um, just hide my avatar. I have too too oh many here. Okay, uh, uh, meshes and, and uh, items. I, I guess. I'm sorry. I never um, optimized this avatar. Yeah, everyone is here. We're so all people. Everyone is here. 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 Hey, that shop smelling me. I know I smell like that. Cube man, thank you, man. Thank you for this night. It was great, man. Yo, Ethel, get your hand off my ass. Oh, there you are. Hacker man, thank you.